Who are you? Greetings, young one. Come to offer us Clipios a sacrifice? No. But I'm searching for a Spartan mother, who may have. The great goddess Ira guides many mothers to the sacred place. Surely I'm too feeble to remember them all. What's Hero the what goddess of? What are these of? stone slabs Again. for? These are uh, records. We document all who pass through, uh, their illnesses, treatments, so that the glory of Asclepios can be celebrated. Then I don't need your memory. I just need to find the right stone. Um, yes, of course. That's very wise indeed. If only I had the time to help you. You gotta go, have fun. Hey Wiggins, thank you so much for stopping by, man. Really appreciate it. And hope you had fun. In the short while you were here. Thank you so much for stopping by, man. Appreciate it. Listen, I am not here to hurt you. Have I'm a great day, man. Just looking for my mother. It's Chrysis. She's got every priest in the sanctuary under her thumb, and she'll squash anyone who feeds information to the eagle bearer. There's a cultist then don't here. Don't tell me anything. Just bring me to the stone that can. Follow me then, quickly. We must be discreet. Lead the way. The only ones who actually have a vendetta on us as the eagle bearer are the cultists. This way, over here. If anyone is watching, they'll have my head. What kind of sanctuary isn't safe for its priests? Times have changed, Eagle Bear. Times change. Oh man, that cinematic from World of Warcraft is so cool. Well, this is probably the first escort quest where the NPC has the same walk speed than me. That again, mine was trouble. Written during the time of the great Elod Revolt, you would have been only a child. I don't need the history, just the details. It tells the tale of a woman with worms in her throat. Asclepios took off her head so we could remove them, then reattached it in her sleep. Definitely not the right one. What the fuck? I wonder what Hippocrates would think of these treatments. Hippocrates is a fine healer. Showed so much promise. Worms in her throat. He's healing the sick right now. He puts too much faith in his hands and not enough in the gods. When it Ugh. comes to life and death, I prefer oh, hands. Going. Are all the testimonies so outrageous? Writers today, Fukividis, Evripidis, the Petrus hey, Aristophanes, all of them try for realism. But what oh, we're just gonna go on a horse. I, 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 I. Oh, we can run. Okay. I'm not fast enough. Oh. Really? You old guy. Can we not mount the horse, sit on its back, so you can go there? Really? You needed a horse for that? So what's this about? This one tells the tale of a man with sword wounds. A pack of dogs licked him clean and Eureka! That's not sanitary. This is hopeless. These stories give people hope, Eagle Bear. Well, I mean, Nobody can read them though except Tell you. A very powerful, dangerous woman. But it was not always. Oh, we're going back? Okay. She was abandoned here as a child and taken in by the priests. I couldn't hear anything he said. She learned very quickly. Was very strong Where the hell are we going? And, uh, Can you find my mommy, please? The who really? To Ten foot? She was loved, but and you're gonna walk all the way back. That's even worse. So, when her methods turned to madness, anyone who opposed her got... God no, God. already said too much. All right. Third time's the charm. And what about this one? Let me guess. It tells the tale of a blind woman who had her eyes licked by snakes. What? It reads, of Sparta, came here with child, sought pity from the gods. Why is most of it scratched out? Uh-oh. Oh, uh, I'm... I'll just tell you. 
I know this one by heart. The Spartan woman arrived filthy and bleeding from her travels. We cared for her, gave her food, a bath, and she left. Where she went, I do not know. The child could not be saved. Who does know where she went? That guy. We've been spotted. Meet me later, near the olive tree of Heracles, at the entrance of the sanctuary. I may have something for you. And what do we have here? A priest and a mercenary out for a friendly stroll? May the gods be with you, Plistos. I was just on my way to the archives when this Mystheus bumped into me. Is that so? And what were you both chatting about so fervently, my Well, that's kind of private. The good priest here was teaching me how to heal sword wounds. Um, yes, sword wounds. Oh, really? And what is the treatment for sword wounds, according to Timoxenos here? Um, um, dogs? Dogs. What about them? They you lick. use dogs to lick the wounds clean. Very good. Don't give away all our tricks, Timoxenos. I guess. Who will bring offerings to the gods when our patients learn to heal themselves? <laughs> no, no, of course not. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have matters to attend to. You have your treatment, Mistios. Now please, leave the sanctuary. This guy's the cultist. His hair is way too slick. Alright, open your map. No. I want to do the other quest first. The, uh, this one. Oh, it's a sub-quest. Okay, never mind. Because the other two points, what were those about? Hmm. Rejoin the old crease. Okay. Northern part, Valley of Dreams, Crossroads, the Olive Tree of Heracles. Oh. We need to look for Crossroads. Which is here. That's, that's a really big tree. You can see that. I can see that. It's not too far. The mini map looks like it's so big, but or the mini map. A massive. You are close to your target. I know. That old priest hiding by the tree. Hmm. Sure surely nobody misses him. This looks gorgeous. What's with those charms? The tree of Heracles. I'm not sure if it's loved more for its legend or its Ooh. olives. Now, where is that? Oh wow! Beast? That is awesome. You can just even in the thick of combat, you can just press both things. That is so cool. That's instant. Hello. Where are you? Hi. That's cool. I thank you for your discretion, Eagle Bearer. Chrysis has many eyes and ears throughout the sanctuary. What else can you hmm. tell me about the Spartan woman and child? The woman left the child's blanket behind. We tried to return it, but it was too painful a memory for her. Where did child she go? Died. What happened to the child? So, Chrysis was right. You knew the rules, Timoxenos. You will suffer her wrath. Please, Tos. Please. It's a cultist. Get <laughs> behind me, priest. I'll deal with these two. No oh, nice shoe. Oh, there's, there's two more soldiers. Uh -oh. You didn't have enough with just this guy? Come on. Give me the flip. Oh, I can't see. Can I take care of you first? This guy. Why is the Spartan soldier attacking me? Is this gonna be the easiest cultist ever? I don't want to kill the Spartan. If I can help it. That's you two? Uh, well, he is going for me, so I might have to kill him. 
That's you. Stop it. That is now my. Wasn't there more? Oh, okay. I'll deal with him last. You know. For aesthetic reasons or something. I don't know. Ah, I was fast. That's you. Ow, you actually hurt. Oh, wow. You made a flip. You know, for a priest, you're quite agile. But he wasn't the most or the cultist. So now what? I still hear battle music. Oh, look at the Spartan fighting a lion. Okay. So now what? That was interesting. We now know that the cultists are here as well. So, this is a new quest. No, it's not. Let's go take a look. The priest is gone. He, he's just... He, he ran. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, it's on the outside. Oh, I'm wait. Oh, okay. For a second, I thought I wasn't allowed to run in there. Make me curious. Right, next. If you're here for your purification bath, you'll have to come back another time. I'm here for information. In that case, you can go straight to Hades. I need to know about a Spartan woman who came through here many years ago. Did that eagle of yours shit in your ears? <laughs> I'm under strict orders not to talk to any mercenaries. Especially not about Spartan women or injured babies. <sighs> I never mentioned the baby. Think you're so smart? Many women pass through with babies. Now leave me. I have my own problems to deal with. Maybe I can help you. Snakes! Snakes. They're everywhere! Must have escaped from the Tholos. What's the we Tholos? keep them for treatments, but they invaded oh. the bathhouse. Uh -oh. The snakes killed someone? A patient was purifying himself when they slithered in. Turns out oh. he's terrified of snakes. Fell over dead. Now the snakes have made him their home. What if I took care him. of your snake problem? Would you talk to me then? Oh, most definitely. The purification bath is crucial in the path towards healing. That is nasty. I'll clear out these snakes in no time. Icarus could use a good feast. Try not to kill them. Lorios will be furious if you sacred snakes get chopped to beats. Then how am I supposed to deal with them? Snakes are drawn to the bath's heat. Flood them with cold water and they'll slither back to their hole. There's an underground pipe that may help you. Mm. I'll take care of your snake problem. Then... You'll tell me what I need to The thing is, you could not have asked. You could not have asked and actually killed them. That would change the quest. Alright. So, sneaky snooze. It's time for you. Well... There's nothing here, so let's check the other side. I can't go in without, without fighting them. Let's take a look. Look who it is. What's up, Billy Sage? How you doing, man? Welcome back, and thank you so much for the 10-month resub, dude. Closing in on the 12th month. Damn. How you doing, dude? You have a side mission where a dude pays your money to sleep with his wife? Yes. 
I did actually do that. That's with the old woman. Yeah, did do that. What am I looking for? It has to be a pipe somewhere? What said so? What's that guy? Look at this guy. He's just swimming. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Oh, there it is. See, an eagle eye truly helps. That's the pipe. Opening it should flood the bath and get rid of the snakes. Yes, so what do I... Okay, that was weird. Maybe it was like a hidden loading screen. Probably. Is it zoomed in? Probably. Alright. Hi. And? Dealt with it. Is the bathhouse free of snakes? Well, I didn't I check. I flooded the bathhouse with cold water. Good riddance. Well? Well what? I took care of the snakes. Now you're going to tell me about the Spartan woman and the baby. Yes. <laughs> I actually don't know anything. It was before my time. The man who does know is Mithun, but he won't tell you. He won't tell anyone anything. <laughs> Look at how furious she is. <laughs> We're gonna stab him right now. I like your snakes. At least I got a name. Miva. Sigh. Okay. Let's go to the, uh, the final one. Should be the final one. I'm good, but it's early for you. Yeah, your work schedule is freaking crazy right now, man. I don't know how you do it. You're crazy. <laughs> Alright, that should be the last of the three. Maybe we'll get some information on my mommy. That'd be great. Ooh, that's a lot of soldiers here. Please help our daughter. Yeah, help the daughter. This is very troubled. May Asclepio spare her from suffering. Will she live? Not unless the gods heed our prayers. Many sick Athenians have arrived in Argolis recently, mm. and very few have left. This poor girl has the same sickness. What is the sickness? Do you guys think something's gonna happen to Phoebe later on in the game? Is there anything I can do to help? Like Demos will I do something? I was warned of the eagle bearer. Wants nothing but drag me for blood. I was told. We're wasting time, priest. We can discuss what I want when this sick girl's needs are taken care of. I want information. to have no cure. And it's spreading. It's Our the plague. Our sacrifices have done little to draw the attention of the gods. Pigs, goats, all have fallen on deaf ears. We need the beast whose blood will ignite these flames for Asclepios to see. What did you have in mind? There is a rumor of a bull with skin as white as snow roaming the sanctuary outskirts. Hmm. Head west of here, towards the coast. Bring it to me alive and will offer a sacrifice the gods cannot ignore. I'm touched you will help these people. But I know why you're really here. Chrysis made all priests swear oaths to seal our lips in the face of the eagle-bearing Mystios. Or forfeit our lives. But I serve the gods and the sick. My oaths are to them. That is nice. I want to know a little bit more about Creases. Hope not, but I have a bad feeling something might. I don't know. It's just too weird they, that they include Phoebe in quests like that, right? It could be anyone. And I highly doubt they only did that because we already know the character, right? So... I have a feeling there's gonna be something to it. Tell me about Chrysis. She has everyone terrified. We taught her everything we knew about healing, about the gods. Then she found new teachers, people in masks. They changed her, turned her heart black. They became her gods. Hmm. So she's a small time cultist then. Okay, cool. Um. Okay. If you're just going to slit its throat, why do you need the bull alive? <laughs> but we're not just going to slit its throat. First, 
we pour water on its head. If it nods, we may proceed. Gods, mortals, and animals, all must be willing participants in a sacrifice, or it is impure. To save this many people, we will need the beast's blood, bones, and fat. Sounds like a grave graveyard keeper task. <laughs> the outskirts are vast. Can you be more specific about the location of the bull? Last I heard, it was grazing on Mount Corifam, near the Asini ruins. Okay, let's go. Let's grab ourselves a I'll bull. How, how am I actually gonna bring it there alive? <laughs> bull spotted roaming near the Asini ruins. Okay. Um, no quest marker. No quest marker. Hello? Oh, that's here. Okay. That's this way. Straight ahead. 